Hey guys, and welcome back to another unfiltered gamer, board game, or something unique video. We're doing a product video today for the company Eldritch Foundry. These guys create miniatures, and they're asking us to go ahead and make some miniatures, show them off to you guys, uh, the process of creating them, and then of course we will check them out uh, when they get here in the mail. I'm going to give you guys the full video so you get to see us making them and then of course you'll get to see us with the product in hand and what it looks I'm like it. <laughs> and give you an opportunity to decide whether you want to pick up any miniatures from Eldritch Foundry. You'll see the entire process here and then you yourself can go down link description to pick up a miniature if you want for your D&D campaign or for really anything you would like to do. So let's go ahead and start. As you can see we have the, the whole website here already set up, Eldritch Foundry. I've went ahead and signed in to my Google account. So I'm already signed in. I've got my credits here, which if you did the Kickstarter, then you would have had credits. Otherwise, you can just simply buy them from the cart. And you're going to start off with just a plain character here. We have the human male. That's what I've clicked on first. Mm -hmm. But there are a plethora of different characters to select from. So, Cal, you can go ahead and select a character. Who um, do you want to pick? Am I going first? Sure. Okay. I am leaning towards that. Elf, female. Dwarf, Goliath, <laughs> Demon, Human, Halfling, Half-Elf, Orc, Goblin, Furbolg, Elf, elf. Wargast, Half-Orc. Okay, Elf, Female? Yes. All right, it's rolling our d20 here. <laughs> Great, so this is going Randomizing to be these... It's, nope, things. it's just the starting character, basically. Okay. After you selected your race, it'll tell you the cost, and you can go ahead and start customizing. So you've got the body type. And there is wow. a ton. Yeah, I took a look at this before we started. A ton of different choices. Yeah. You want your head like that? No. Okay. More normal head size. Something like that. Yeah. Shoulders? Yeah, no. <laughs> There's not going to be a warrior or anything, so warrior should need the shoulder size. She's maybe, maybe, maybe yeah, like a little, little so, lower. something it's probably like Cali a, size. A major priest, yeah. All right. <laughs> Skinny like you, then, huh? Um, Let's see how big we can get her. Okay, she's just like muscular or non-muscular, basically. Mm -hmm. uh, what else? Whoa! Okay then. <laughs> well, there you go. And waist. What are you looking for? What are you looking don't for? Don't eat. Wait, stop. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> oh, no, we, oh, we can rotate it too. That's nice. <laughs> and we can zoom in. Okay. This kind of reminds me of the Sims, uh, creating a, a different character. You want, you, want, you want a small butt? Either. Well, not too small. <laughs> all right. All right, and then that's pretty much those all those options, that's right? The body. Options. And they can choose to make them linked or not linked. You can unlink them. So, for instance, I can do my left chat, my left. <laughs> Boom. Well, that was an interesting one to choose. <laughs> I, I just clicked on, I thought, oh, it said chest. I wasn't thinking about it. And, but you can also go ahead and make it so it's, you know. They're the same. Yeah. Okay. Uh, face. Look at that. I think it's real nice and oh, okay. close and personal here. So I'm guessing happy is how much smiling? Oh, okay. Or frowning. Something like that. You're going to be angry. Angry, angry happy. Angry happy. <laughs> no. Oh. <Aww. laughs> nah. Let's do it. Nah, just like closed. Yeah, there you go. Uh -huh. Hmm. Uh huh. Hmm. And then, nah, no rotate. Okay. What do you <laughs> do? Twist. Keep it back down, down. Something like that. That looks normal, I guess. Horns. Oh. Wait, she's an elf, though. Maybe she's a horny elf. <laughs> uh, no. You can have no horns, right? But she has no horns. Okay. How do you do no horns? I said I click at it again. Uh, okay. okay. Pretty yep. intuitive. Yep. Got it. <sighs> I got a lot of hair choices here. You want to go with oh. Callie from like a year ago? A year ago? Let me see. Like I'm, I'm looking for the... Four years ago? I don't know. The one we have like... <laughs> no. Well, no, that's not, that's not Callie from four years ago. What's <laughs> the one we have? Where's the... Okay, there's no super short hair then. Like pixie yeah, cut. Yeah, there's Kai. Okay, okay, that's it. That'd yeah. be Callie from... A couple years ago. Okay. I want, um, have a high ponytail up there. This one? Look, that's a braid. <laughs> this? Tell me. Tell me when to stop. Yeah. Up there, one of those. Yeah. That looks fun. Okay. Right, we got your hair set up. Uh-huh. Eyebrows. Gotta have some 
Okay, let's go with the middle one. Normal, normal. Normal. <laughs> this this <laughs> thing is normal. Eyewear. Whoa! I don't think we need that eyewear. How about just one eye patch? A monocle. Oh, it's not a monocle. It's both. Oh. Oh, that's kind of. Cool. <laughs> She's like a night Whoa. elf from World of Warcraft. Oh yeah. Double eye patch. <laughs> Do just one eye patch. I'm gonna be boring, I guess. Alright. You want a beard? No! Yeah! No bearded elf. We just a uh, mustache. Yes. If you've <laughs> only got a mustache, a mustache. No? No, thank you all. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Elegant, <laughs> yet sophisticated. <laughs> is there any Josh? Oh, there is a Josh looking one. Oh, ones. yeah, with the braids. And, and the just the, this or is the that. this there is the go. just Josh one right here. Uh -huh. Okay, no no mustache, no beard. No. Right. You want a tail? Ooh, crazy. Ooh, you get a little tail going on. Maybe you want a little bit of some bits going on. Oh, a little spiky one. Spiky is cute, but I think not. Wings though. Let's see the wings. Okay, you got three I can choices. Maybe be persuaded on these. Yeah, like got fairy like wings. An elf fairy. Ooh, we got a bit, a bit of a gargoyle going on. Ooh, a griffin looking griffin. wing. Angel kind of wing. Yeah. yeah. Fairy, angel, gargoyle. Eh, eh. Um, maybe fairy, fairy. Be like a fae elf. Okay. Kinda. Yeah. No tail. Okay, so we did all of these guys here. Yep. Next so we got clothing. clothing. Good, she needs some clothing. <laughs> all right. You want any of these things? Um, any neck pieces? Maybe. You know, neck pieces? I'll decide that at the end. I might interfere with her wings. Helmets? You want a helmet? Oh, or hat? I don't know if you have a hat. You have a, you have a oh, ponytail. Oh, I have a ponytail. Okay, nope, I can't do that. Yeah, I got the high ponytail. Want some, want some pauldrons? Yeah. Oh, take off the neck gear, though, first. I have so, one. Yeah. We'll be here for like an hour. I know. <laughs> not, she takes forever to decide yeah. things. How about, yeah, those look <laughs> fun. Little, just like little, little, little thing. Okay. You want a Neo cloak? <laughs> That's cute. Look Take the red pictures. pill. <laughs> there you go. No. No? Mm. Oh, okay. You go down one more. Wait, there's too many choices. Okay. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> no bikini. No, no. Go back up. Oh. Go to back up to the one of the actual shirts. <laughs> that one looks. Wait, no. Up one again. Yeah, there you go. Let me get some gloves. Well, nothing too armory, because she's more of a magic user. It's just like a little bit of protection. Like, some, some wraps. Some gloves. Oh, uh, wait. Yeah, uh, those ones. Yeah, sure. Like, I got some... They look like heavy-duty gardening gloves. Pants. Mage pants, huh? Mm-hmm. Little shorts? No. No? Little shorty shorts? Or more like a skirt or something. Let's see what we got here. Yeah. Oh. So that it's looks too much like Too armory. armory. Too yeah. armory. Okay. So that's my Aladdin Prince Ali. <laughs> Fabulous he. No? No. What's the one below that Aladdin? Is that? This one? Like a... Um, butt's kind of hanging out. Yeah, no. Nah. It's a little yeah. more ranger looking. It, that could work, this, almost. Maybe. Liking that? Or go up to two. That one. There we go. She's okay. got like a. You want a cape? Probably not. Mm, no. Nah. Feet? Definitely need some boots on her. Something like that, huh? Yeah, something more like. There's a wizarding one too. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. There All right. We go. All right. Items? 
All right, do we need, what do we, what do we want to give her? We want to give her okay, magic definitely effects. definitely some, some magic. Yeah, crystals, she can hold lightning. She can hold different, the fire in one hand. Oh, oh, yeah. Maybe not magic effects, fire maybe nice. magic focus. I like that one. Or like a, like a staff or something. Look at a that. wand, yeah. Harry, take the wand! Whoa. That's a that's like a shaman stick. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. That's a really large staff. Yeah. Oh. You want a wand or you want a staff? What are you looking at? I like the staff at the the last staff. Yeah. Okay. That one's cool. You want, what do you want in the other hand? Are we gonna paint these two? <laughs> probably. We'll, we'll probably paint them. Yeah. Bum 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 bum. Alright, what else do you want? You want something in the other hand? No. I think she no Isn't tools? You don't want like Oops, oops, I just I just switched off. You gave me a frying pan. <laughs> you don't want a frying pan? No. Frying pan on the other hand, perhaps? No. Yes. Cooks at no. night. Fights in the morning. <laughs> Buy me a frying pan. Oh. Chops wood. You can do a frying pan on your miniature. Uh -huh. I got wings, so I don't need anything. You want a musical there. instrument? No. Okay. All right, so we finished. There's a lot to choose from. What's the side item at the bottom? Side item? Yeah. Oh, that's something you put on the side of the character. Oh, we can have on. Okay. Okay. Maybe she wants a rope, like Indy. <laughs> no. And a, a little pouch. A little pouch. It's kind of weird because it's her arm. Yeah, my there. arm doesn't work with that one. Well, but... but however, you can change the pose though. Oh, okay. So maybe okay. We'll, have a, we'll have that, and we'll go to the poses. Yeah. So we can do advanced posing, which I think we're not going to skip. We're going to do one of the normal poses. Yeah. Uh, pre, oh, pre -poses. oh, my back hurts so bad. That one's for you. <laughs> oh, oh, that's for, oh, my, oh, yeah, that is literally my sciatic <laughs> nerve pose right there. Every morning I wake up and this is me right here. This is what I look like. Just, well, just arched like over in pain. 10, 15 minutes when you gotten up. <laughs> okay. See, there you go. Now you got your thing there going on. I'm going to whack you. Oh. Ooh, pretty, pretty. Oh, that would but that probably pouch be better. doesn't work, though. Yeah, the pouch doesn't work with that. Mm, that kinda one works. Kind of works. Yeah. Kind of works. I kind of okay. like that one. There's another one. Oh, oh that one works, too. To kind of got her stance there. Like, yeah. ready to cast a spell. You want that one? Yeah. All right, there you go. And then you get your miniature. You choose the preset pose where you set on manual pose changes. Yeah, so if you choose a preset, but you were previously doing manual, well, yeah. then you're going to lose it's, that. It's going to default. Yep. And there you go. Uh, now we get to go ahead and do our base, which is kind of cool. So you get to choose the base of your character. Do you uh, want it to be a circular base? Right? I mean, like a little bit of a magical circle there? A little runic circle. It's got runes and stuff on it. That's kind of cool. I like that. I could try that. I and mean, then we could add a base item too. Perhaps you want some skulls. No. How about a little, like, that's little like dude's a head. head. No. Maybe like a treasure chest. Treasure chest. No, it doesn't go with the magic thing. How about a little, no, a little snowman no. with an axe? <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. That is so cute. Yes. A little helmet. I know that there's, I'm pretty sure there's like a candle or something. Like, there you go, there's a little candle there. Okay. Or little, like a crystal or something coming up. Yeah, crystal, there, there we crystals. go. Crystal. Yeah. Okay. So you got a fairy mage, elf, going on with your big staff. Yep. Looks pretty good. Mm -hmm. Looks pretty good. So uh, I fear we may have run out of time. We're, we're, I think we're pushing about 15 minutes here, so we're going to do the next video here, uh, which we'll just cut instantly for you guys, but for us it's going to be we'll let you know how long it takes for the item to get here, or items. Mm -hmm. I'll probably do another one here. I don't know. I might. I will see if I I'm, You can I'm, do a speed through though, you know. I might do something like that at the end yeah. of the video, but uh, this is good enough to give you an idea of how you can create your miniatures, and how you can pose them, how you can pretty much customize it to almost any degree that you mm -hmm. want. Um, yeah, pretty, pretty crazy that you can get so in depth. Don't mess it up. <laughs> There's a lot of choices here. Uh huh. Oh, you can save it too. I can. So what do I save? On the left it? there, the big yellow save. On the, no, left, left. There. Oh, 
There you go. Okay. That way I don't lose your mini now. Yeah. That way you get to keep it. <laughs> your mini was saved successfully. Woohoo! I'm curious, do they have do we, the ability oh, to... Oh, you add it to the cart then when you're ready. Okay. Do they have the ability to change the eyes and stuff? Like move the eyes around and... The face was just happy or angry. I think it moved the whole face around. Okay, so it all it does all that automatically for you then. Yeah. Okay. See that the eyes kind of move as well as the lips. Make it nice and easy. All right, well, we go to our credits. Okay, we have two. I want to go there. Now to... you want to add to cart. Oh. Yeah. What the heck did I do here? I don't know. <laughs> you, want, you want that one? No, thank you. Oh, email. Edit. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Okay, add to cart. Yes. Okay. And there we have it. One wonderful elf mm -hmm. female character. Nice. You can also name yourself, too. We'll call it... Uh... Sorgal Magi. <laughs> it's a pretty cool Magi. name, if you ask me. And then that's it. You go ahead and check it out. You give them all your information, which we're not going to be showing you here. And uh, we will go on to the next part of the video. Thank you for uh, joining me. We'll come back for the next video and show them what, what you got and maybe what I got as well. Can't wait to see it. So here we are, what, about a month later or so? Yeah, maybe a little longer. Maybe a little maybe. longer than a month. Yeah, and it went by quickly. <laughs> we have received our Eldritch Foundry miniatures. Now, I had two separate videos set up to discuss both of the miniatures that we made, mine and yours, of course. Mm -hmm. Maybe I'll probably just put them all at the beginning of this video, and then we'll just talk about them now as they are. They've come in these boxes here, and they are our customized miniatures that uh, we got to make. So yeah. we're going to go ahead and pull them out and show you guys what they look like. You want to go ahead and show them? Yeah, first? I can't wait to open them up. <laughs> All right, go ahead. Go ahead and grab it. Pull okay. it off. So this is a tin right yep. here. I'm going to open it up. Got a little cushion there. And here is my little fairy elf character. She's got her staff and her wings. <laughs> wow, we added a lot of stuff to these characters to kind of customize them. Uh, yeah, they have a lot of detail detail and options that you can make. You can even bring it even closer to the camera if you want so people can get a good look at it. Okay, there we go. And top. Oh, no, no. Oh, you broke it. No, no, no. She's okay. <laughs> <laughs> bring her up. So this is a black plastic, it looks like. it's. I wouldn't say it's it's on part of Simon style, like, uh, thickness. So it's not something that I would suggest you bend too much. Like, it you could probably break it. kind of delicate, but, that's, but it also seems kind of strong at the same time. I don't know if that's just because there's a lot of detail that it seems kind of more delicate. Yeah, yeah, there's a lot of stuff going on. But what yeah, I'm just trying to say great. is it's not a hard plastic. It's not something... Uh, it's definitely going to be more bendable. You're going to have pieces that kind of move around a little bit more on uh, um, as you kind of put pressure on them. Mm -hmm. So I wouldn't suggest you trying to bend them in a 90 degree angle. I imagine they will break. Yeah. Uh, it's also got like a sheen or like kind of like it's a sparkle. sparkly. So it's got a little bit of, uh, yeah, sparkle to it. A little bit of glitter in the resin. And as far as the detail goes, I think they do an excellent job. It's mm -hmm. exactly what I imagined it would look like. And they didn't make any little, I, I didn't see any mess ups as far as the print goes. Yeah, it looks exactly what I wanted. So that's great. It is the black is a little hard to see. It's very dark. So it's kind of hard to see some of the detail. But for the most part, if you are customizing a miniature like this, you're going to want to paint it anyway. <laughs> and then we have mine. This is, I went uh, above and beyond on purpose. I wanted to see how, if I could kind of mess the system up. So we'll go ahead and bring this guy to you so you can get a good look at him. And here he is. This is my... I don't know, flying cyborg pistol dude with he's got a tail. He's got all he's got a little snowman with he went an axe a crazy on him. When we were creating these. Very we very did. big. <laughs> it's got kind of like a, a like a, a wet feeling on the bottom of the uh, of the piece too. I noticed it's like wet a little bit. You know what I mean? Like oh. Slippery almost. Oh, it's because it's sleek compared to the the texture on the other side. Yeah, all of it feels feels kind of sleek. Um, highly detailed. 
well-made piece. Uh, they didn't mess up anything, even though I really tried to get them to mess something up. I wanted to see if I could get the tail to get kind of messed up. Or you pushed the limits of it. Yeah, I did. <laughs> I mean, obviously, there's certain things that you could have you would have known based on your model that would have shown that it was going to mess up. But in this case, it does a very good job of ma of printing up the model that you exactly would like. Even the detail on the bottom here. Uh, of, of, of it's going to be nice. I'm going to paint these guys for sure. At least I'll paint mine. Maybe me and Kelly will paint ours and we'll have yeah. them up on Instagram. But yeah, Eldritch Foundry. A very good job. Very nice quality. The, Came with the, a nice tin The as well. tin box is uh -huh. nice as well. You know, basically like one of those mint tin style game uh, <laughs> pieces. And you put your little guy in there. I like that because a lot of times for miniatures you don't have storage <laughs> if it's not part of a game. <laughs> Yeah, and I honestly, they did a really good job of this miniature. Now, is it pricey? Is it going to be something you can afford? Obviously, this is a customized miniature that you're making one of. And whenever you make one of anything, expect the price to go up. For instance, Kelly's game, we're working on Moonshell. That game is going to be expensive when it comes to the first couple prototypes we make for manufacturing, expecting it to cost a couple hundred dollars per prototype, where the game might retail for 30 or something yeah, like that. Yeah, when you manufactured in mass, it drives the price down. Yes, so when you're making one specifically detailed model, things will gonna get more expensive. However, this price is reasonable. It's something that I expect to mm -hmm. see uh, whenever you're making like a D&D &D campaign yeah, or a character. Yeah, you have a specific character that you wanna have a special model for. Or maybe you want just a couple of are. them and base them off of like the different types of items you get and what you're gonna equip and all that kind of stuff. Yeah, you could have different mer versions of your own character. There's a lot of customization with Eldritch Foundry, and they do a very good job of allowing you to kind of customize it to however you would like and make it look as fancy as you can possibly make it. I had a lot of fun with the system. I didn't have a lot of complaints. I, a couple little things I, I would say is probably that the plastic might be a little softer than I would have liked. I probably prefer the, I like the harder plastic, so I know that if I drop it, it's not going to ex explode. But I mean, it's obviously not going to explode. You just yeah, dropped it. Yeah, I just dropped it. It just feels very, it feels more more fragile not very fragile but more fragile than i'm used to for a lot of the thicker miniature molds yeah i think that's just part of the the level of detail there as well yeah as far as the complexity that we tried i tried to push it to its limit and it did a very good job of with withholding that complexity we both did wings are hard to yeah do. yeah they they did a really good job of these guys i'm yeah. really really proud of my model i think it came out and very you got a very tail nice too or something. i got a Wait, tail no, wings i have two whip. whips Two whips, a snowman with an axe, a tail, <laughs> yeah, the wings, the double weapons, and with their, both their hands going up. I've got a vest, I've got a helmet, I've got even horns. a visor, and horns, <laughs> and the horns even came out yeah, nice, Yeah, you can too. see them. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> very, very good job. They made this very, very nicely. Very easy to tell that they put the time and effort to make sure that the designs match the prints. So we got our little I'm very little satisfied here. with this. Ready to go on an adventure. Um, I'd like to see. Oh, oh. Uh, maybe I didn't see this. I don't know. I have to go back and check again, but I'd like to see the different types of plastic I could p choose from. Maybe not. Maybe different types of plastic, different colors. Maybe. Oh, different colors. Instead yeah. of maybe, maybe I don't want the. Uh, or or a wash or something. Yeah, or maybe I just don't want the glitter. You know, it's got like this like, glittery mm -hmm. look to it. Maybe I'd like something just white or even even just a gray. I like the glitter. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that would be kind of something nice to see if customized, but uh, I mean, really, I can't complain. This has been something that I haven't seen done. I mean, th these are these are new things that are starting to come mm -hmm. out now, but like 10 years ago, you would have never been able, been able to do this. So now the kind of sky's limit for what kind of customization you like to have. Mm -hmm. Overall, Eldritch Foundry, a very solid uh, miniatures creation it's website. It's a fun experience, too, to create your own. <laughs> your own character. I always like making my own things and this is a yeah. very easy process to do so and it comes straight to you in a very nice tin, high quality, overall excellent experience. I give mm -hmm. these guys an A plus. Thumbs up. <laughs> okay, bonus round. I'm gonna go ahead and make my character and I'll show Kelly how it's done correctly Ooh. in Eldritch Foundry. <laughs> and the first thing I'm gonna need to do is find a character of elegance and pride. Well, are you gonna do a demon? Reflect your soul in your character. <laughs> I don't know. I'm feeling, I'm feeling the Goliath. Goliath. <laughs> he's a big guy. He's pretty. He's pretty manly. Ooh. That's a human. It's pretty cool looking too. 
How about a furb furb hold? What is a furbold? A uh, Furby? I used to have those when I was a kid, you know, <laughs> and they would always go naughty. like meh meh and you'd have to like put stuff you remember to touch their tongue? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And they would do stuff. Mm -hmm. You guys know what I'm talking about. Uh, ghost I don't know what the ghost gas. That was the thing that War No War gas. Error. War gas. Like okay. a mechanical I think we're going with this guy. Let's do it. Let's do it. Alright, body type. Head, shoulders, arms, legs. <laughs> that, eh, let's reflect. I'm, I was here, but I've lost some weight, so maybe I'm about here now. Now the character. Oh, the, uh. yeah. Got some man moves. Maybe just a little bit, you know? Just a little bit. <laughs> some, something to show for. Okay, waist. Yeah. You don't right need there. a waist, yeah. Something like that. But I mean, you but, don't need a butt. Wait a minute. Oh. Ooh la la. Okay. He's, realistically, I don't have a butt, so we're, we're gonna go. We're gonna go with that. Okay. Okay. It's pretty pretty straightforward. Oops, oh, you didn't want to. Yeah, 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 yeah. He is upset because he's still not uh, beach body ready. Well, a human. He's not beach body ready. He's gonna have a little twist too. He's like, Arr. then we're gonna go with horns. Of course, he's gonna have horns. Wait, but like a uh, mechanical. Well, creature, right? he was a centaur, mm -hmm. but then the war ghasts found him, and they took his heart and made him into a mechanical thing. But his okay. horns stayed. Okay. So that's why I Got never me. do RPG stuff. <laughs> Got to create a backstory. Uh, Some pigtails. Kind of digging the long... The long hair looks good. Kind of like um, uh, The Witcher, right? Yeah. <laughs> it's gonna have some. No, I don't think we want eyebrows. It doesn't need eyebrows. Oh. Ooh, More maybe. like steampunk. <gasps> yes. We're gonna go with the World of Warcraft, uh, the Demon Hunters. I don't know if it works with your hair, though. Uh, <laughs> it's true. It's true. Maybe I can switch the hair just a little bit. Or it's still. So long. There was another. No. That is like, that's like princess female. looking. There, down the new one. Yeah. 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 Better. I think that'll that's work. Better. I think yeah. that'll work. Beard. It feels like robots need beards. Do they? What? <laughs> Do they though? Oh. The A robot beard sounds about right. <laughs> Can't even tell he's a robot anymore. That's the point. He's the he's very dis he's disappointed in the fact that he was created the way he is. So he's that covered it up. He's covered. He's, he's, <laughs> that's not gonna work. No, that's the, the twisting of the jaw didn't work with the beard. Yeah. <laughs> I guess we won't do a beard. Uh, a tail. The centaurs have tail. They do. They do have well, tails. They have horse tails. Uh, not like. Scorpion dragon tail. Maybe we'll get that going on then. Like s snake tail. <laughs> and he also happens to have wings because... Why not? <laughs> that's cool. <laughs> I'm feeling wings. Alright, clothing. We want to stress test the wings on how they... <laughs> okay, we're not going to do any of this stuff, unfortunately. Gonna it's going to be too much your... stuff. We're not going to do a helmet, unfortunately. There you go. This reminds me of E. Honda I, from Street Fighter. Yeah. Like sumo. I do wrestler. like how male or female can wear pretty much all of the clothing and accessories. Yeah, just choose whatever you want, I guess. Uh -huh. <laughs> okay, I like. He's kind of like an angel now. Angel? Okay, we're going with that. That looks good. Gloves. I'm more like a demon. <laughs> Does he need claw gloves? I feel like he needs claw gloves, you know? That's too much. I feel like claw gloves are what is up. Maybe, oh. maybe like, like knife gloves, the ones that shoot out the little Green knives. Oh. Yeah, something, something like that. More there. steampunk style. 
He's Stand mechanical. Punk Angel. He's mechanical. Yeah, he's he's just got a lot of backstory. It's a very very popular <laughs> character. Oh no, that's not gonna work at all. <laughs> oh, come on. What? You not feeling that? No. Come on, he's got like. I don't know. <laughs> that's pretty cool, actually. I don't know. <laughs> you don't know? <laughs> no. <laughs> that's weird. He's like heavy here, but like he's really tiny there. <laughs> no. I think I think this is what's up. And hopefully okay. we can make the feet work. Well, the feet, you don't need shoes with those feet. Yes, you do. Yeah, I show off those feet. No, he's, he's, he's sad about his... Oh, his, okay, he's going to cover him ooh. up. Ooh. Yeah, that's kind of cool. It's kind of okay. like armored and fluffy, like it gives, it attaches like the wings. Like the wings, okay. See, see, I'm... I do them the same color there. A cape? Doesn't work with the wings and the tail <laughs> and the hair. <laughs> Too much going Stress on. test. Sometimes okay. Okay. Less is more. No. You always say that. Okay. Now you need weapons. Is he? You know what? Guns. He, I feel like guns is in is in his future. Wow. Yeah. Get both of them. Do I want dual yeah, pistol dual wield. Mayhaps I want a German Luger in the other hand. Oh, that's actually rather large. It's like I don't know what that is. <gasps> <laughs> yes! Yes! That's, That's what I'm feeling. That's all you feeling. get then, for uh, all the uh, handheld items. I get, I get a back item too. No, you have wings. Come on, make it work. Oh, almost. That, <laughs> that... The flag? It kind of almost works. It's a little big though. Oh, these are, rather, these are rather large. <laughs> Stress test. No. Oh, no. Oh, no. These nope, are all nope, too big. Nope. What's that? That's weird. That's not gonna work. No. Okay. I can't. I can't make it work. But side items. What do I need? Whips. I feel like whips. Why do you need two whips? Whips. <laughs> so that when my ammo runs out, I can be like the guy head. from Iron Man. <laughs> They're also electrical. And now I need a pay now I need a pose. I think we'll go with that. Mm -hmm. And then he's gonna have to have <laughs> no. I, the snowman with the axe. It's just needed, you know. Really. It's just needed. Yeah. Okay. I'm happy. I'm satisfied with my backstory and my character. It's rather what, nice. What's your character's name? Um. <laughs> or description. <laughs> A centaur robot angel. So obviously his name is Sir Angel. Mm. I guess. Add to cart. Bonus character. <laughs> All right. I hope you enjoyed watching this extra little bit of video. We're gonna go ahead and pick these things up and see what they look like.